it is laundry day okay i'm washing my clothes i'm washing my bedding my bed is a mess okay my bed is a whole mess so i need to wash my bedding i need to make up my bed so that's what we're going to be doing today okay not a lot of bed. and i probably shouldn't be touching water especially cold water since i'm this sick but i want to get this out of the way okay so yeah the time right now is like around 10. I've been awake for a min, not that long anyways, because I didn't get a proper, like, good sleep. Like, I didn't sleep at all, guys. Like, my nose was blocked. You know how it is when your nose is blocked. Like, you can't breathe. And how the fuck are you supposed to sleep when you can't breathe? <laughs> so that's what was happening during the night. I was moving a lot, like, oh my gosh. I felt like I had a headache, but I didn't have a headache. And if I did have a headache, I didn't want to take something for the headache. <laughs> Anyways, guys, yeah. I'm going to set you guys up. And I'm going to take out the washing machine from the garage. And we're going to load. I'm going to start off with my bedding because it's clean. It's just that it's clean, okay? It's not like the bedding that you would like it's not as dirty like a child sleeps in it like it's clean but i just want to wash it so that like it can smell nice and all on that okay so we're gonna start with the bedding anyways like let me not talk a lot let me start moving because this vlog is gonna be like long as without me like moving but anyways like i have the tripod we're gonna set it outside <laughs> Well, <laughs> <laughs> That's that's the hugest garden that we have. As I was saying, my mama has chickens. And she um like we use the the oh my gosh, what's the name of this oh my god y'all? Like I forgot <laughs> So we use the corn. Guys, guys, English just left head so we use the corn she uses the corn that's in the garden to feed the chickens but as you guys saw like the garden is like huge and the corn has like grown like probably six feet tall and there's other stuff that grows like weeds there's like a lot of weeds in there so it's kind of like a struggle to get into the garden especially like the back of the garden because that's where like a lot of corn is because here at the front a lot of corn is like too dry and a lot of corn like we've already eaten it well she's already eaten it and all of that so she has to go to the back to get corn for the chickens is it corn y'all am i saying it right guys please let me know in the comment section if i'm saying this thing right is it corn I think it is, but yeah, we use. So yeah, she. That's what she. That's what we were talking about right now. That like, there's. It's like a struggle getting into that garden to get corn, and she can't be buying like corn in town when there's a huge garden with corn. Like, doesn't make any sense. <laughs> so change your plans, y'all. I know I said that I was gonna make porridge, but. I still need to wash the dishes and the part that I want to use is dirty. So we're just going to make 
tea and bread and that's it. Why let you pay a lot of time? I got to the time I pay for fifteen minutes. Why, Peter? Yo, I better have you too bad. I'm a saddle, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I do Guys, I feel way. I feel like um. <laughs> My mom says my my clothes are gonna go worse because I'm using cold water to wash my clothes. But um, I also think it's gonna get worse. But I feel like it's better to just get over with it now. I don't wanna wait till I'm better and then catch a cold again. No. Let me quickly show you guys my bed, how it looks. So this is how my bed looks right now. I'm gonna remove this sheet. Um, I don't like putting my sheet on top of the mattress, the ma the mattress. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to first lay like a blanket. There's a blanket that I use. I'm going to first lay it on top of the mattress and then I'm going to put a sheet on top of it. But I'm not going to use this pink sheet right there because I just washed my cream sheet. And also this pink sheet is really dark. If it was a lighter pink, it would have went perfectly with my bedding. But I'm going to remove it. And also here, in this blanket right here, I have all like my eyeshadow palettes that don't have any space. I really don't know where I'm going to put those eyeshadow palettes. I need to figure out, like I need to figure out where I'm going to put them. There's a shelf in my sister's wardrobe. It's like a mess. I can, when I have time, I can probably clean up that shelf. Kind of like split it into two and like put her stuff on the other side and then this other side I can use for like my eyeshadows. But I also feel like I want a box so that I can put these eyeshadow palettes on a, in a box. I have a laundry. I No, not a laundry. I have a makeup bag. I, I think you guys probably saw it. But it used to belong to my mom. It's pretty old. It's, it, she, it was bought in the 80s. It's really old. <laughs> um, I can use that makeup bag and put all of these eyeshadows in that makeup bag. And then take the makeup bag and put it in the clear space on the shelf. But I'm really tired, y'all. Oh my gosh. Like, I want to sleep. That's all I want to do. I want to sleep. So the time right now is... Oh my gosh. Yeah, so the time right now is 11.40. My clothes, like the first batch is probably going to be dry around, not all of it, but the bedding will probably be dry around one, half past one, maybe two. And then once it's dry, I'll quickly make up my bed. But right now, guys, oh my gosh. I like, guys, I, I'm really, like, my eyes hurt everything hurts i just want to sleep that's what i want to do so i'm just going to quickly take a nap morning guys so it is tuesday morning um i know that yesterday i said that i was gonna make my bed after like after my bedding has dried and all of that but like 
it dried pretty late and i was just too lazy to like make the bed so i'm gonna make it now because i just woke up like an hour ago yeah so that's what we're gonna be doing right now and don't mind the laundry right there well it's not really laundry it's just that there's like it's clean clothes but we, my sister just put them there anyways let's just get right into making this bed okay let me just lower this tripod i got it one little fight and my mom got scared i said you're moving with your auntie and uncle in bel-air i bet that lady with her day after day but she packed my suitcase and sent me on my way she gave me a kiss and then she gave me my ticket okay guys so i don't have what's that white thing that goes inside your duvet cover is it a duvet filler a duvet inner whatever i don't have that and the duvet that i have like i have a, we ha here at home I have regular regular duvet and i don't like the colors like it's this one right here as you guys can see it's like pink blue it's like multicolored. i don't i don't want that and this right here is my duvet cover this right here i like this because it has pillowcases that match like my pillows match this they don't match that okay so i'm gonna put this inside of this Okay, just just watch and you understand. <laughs> I'm sure you don't have one. Hi, Mommy. Hi, Mommy. It's a movie. Look how long one will be chilling. No, 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 Ujani <laughs> 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 How are you? Is <laughs> okay guys so i just like changed into like proper clothes also i'm going to be like uh wiping down my makeup and i'm going to be using these wipes that i got from uh this came i got those for like 20 rand i don't know if they were on sale or if those are like the normal that's the normal price but it's water wipes and i'm just gonna be picking my like taking out my makeup from like the bags and putting it in like proper places so that i can put it in the wardrobe i just found like 
a tiny tiny bit of space on the wardrobe just to fit like my makeup and my toiletries so that's what i'm gonna be doing right now you guys have probably seen me like you guys have seen how i wipe down my makeup if you haven't i will leave the video up on the cards right here okay guys so this is how everything is packed right now so i'm just gonna remove so the box that you guys are seeing oh my gosh i'm about to break stuff right now <laughs> so this box right here this one it's my e-filer so on top of it i put this makeup bag that has all of my eyeshadows and my face powders and on top right there is the box that i keep my jewelry in and then this box right here is my foundation concealers and primers and then i have this box right here i think this box was from take a lot this one right here also has like my mask my mask sheets my eyeshadows and also like my my eyelashes and then at the back at the back of this brush right here it's all of my lipstick my lipstick holders and then you see all of my brushes and then all of these and these are my perfumes and then we have this bag right here this is all of my like toiletries skincare all of my like uh my brushes also guys look at this brush this brush right here is from scarlet hill mr price of 20 rand this is an edge brush guys like what the heck scarlet hill is definitely like it's doing the most right here anyways and then we have right here all of my uh my my um my spritz perfume mist right here and then this is hair stuff and that's about it that's about it so that's how everything is going right now and also guys i think I, I don't know if i've mentioned it in this video before but because i'm going to be like living here at home i don't really have space for my clothes here at home like the wardrobe has been taken over by my sister because my sister lives here full time and also my mom they've taken all of the wardrobe space i don't have any wardrobe space as you guys can see there that was the only little bit of space that i can kind of like find so the rest of my clothes well half of my clothes are gonna be in the suitcase so i'm gonna be living out of a suitcase i'm gonna show you guys let me just show you guys quickly right here so i did find a little bit of space i did find this whole shelf right here had my mom's clothes but i removed all of those clothes and i put it in another shelf that was like too small for my stuff so this right here is all of my clothes like most of my clothes are here there's like and like there's the front and then there's the back right there and this right here is like jerseys and then right here, I think I have dresses and skirts. And then also here, like my hoodies. And then at the back there, there's jeans. And then right there, there's jerseys and polo necks at the back. And on the other side, I don't remember. But also like my jacket, there's no space to hang. Like my, my, uh, my coats and all of that. So all of my stuff that I usually hang is going to be to be in the suitcase also so like that's 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 just what i get like that's what i get and also guys like i i've been a university student for like nine years now okay so when i left to go to varsity my first year like i lost my space i basically lost all of the closet space that i had and my sister who lives who's been living at home full time since i went to varsity she took over she took over and like the closet on the closet it's her clothes it's my niece's clothes and then the other two closets that we have in this room right there in this room here it's my mom and my brother's clothes so i'm like a visitor i'm basically a visitor okay but i really don't mind because as i got as i said the other day like i'm really not planning on living here at home full time I'm, I'm i'm praying that something comes up and you know 
I, I leave and I have my own place, you know. But so I don't really mind living in a suitcase. Okay, y'all. So now that I'm done with everything that needs to be done in my room, I need to wash my hair because I look like a crazy person under this thing. Okay, I look like a crazy person. Also, let me show you. Uh, no, I'm not gonna show you guys because I was gonna show you how I put my bags. Like I figured out the way to store my bags, but I don't wanna show you my bags because I wanna shoot like a bag video, like showing you guys my bags. But anyways, yeah, I did figure out a way, like, where to put my bags. So, I need to find, I need to look for my shampoo and conditioner. I don't really know where I store it. Yeah, that's what I need to do. Let's just go find this thing. Okay, so, and that suitcase right there, I'm thinking it's probably there. So I'm thinking that my shampoos are probably in this suitcase. So what I have here is all of my clothes that I keep in in the hangers. All of it is here. Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> How the heck am I? Uh I don't think it's here. Oh, yep. So here. Where's the other one? So my nails are like raggedy. This one right here is like, you guys can see, like you can, you can see it's gone. So I need to file it off because my hair is going to catch on this nail. I need to file off all the lifted nails, take them off because they're going to catch on my hair and my hair is going to break. Okay. And no, 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 no. So looking at these nails, I think these two right here need to come off. Okay. I'm too lazy, but I need to do it if I want to wash my hair today. Okay guys, so my hair right now is dry. It's really, it's not dry, 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 but it's not as wet as I usually like it to be before I moisturize it. So yeah, so I just tied it in these like um, two twist thingies and, di and this is just to like stretch out my hair because i don't use heat in my hair which means that i don't use hair dryers and i don't use um straighteners i used to use a straightener on my hair like once a year but the last time i straightened my hair i think it was 20 i think it was 2016 august if i'm not mistaken i think that was the last time i straightened my hair but right now what I'm going to do is I'm going to moisturize it. And what I usually like to do is I like it to be a little bit wet. And then I would go on, go in with this castor oil from, um, from Discam or any castor oil that you have. And the castor oil is, because the castor, castor oil is so thick, um, I like to think that it kind of like retains or kind of like locks a little bit of that like water in the hair 
and then what i will do is i'll go in with the coconut oil i ran out of this coconut oil and then i will go on, on top of the coconut oil i will use these Alpha true products from clicks and i have the beeswax these are Alpha true uh the beeswax has carrot and argan oil and i have the hair food here and the hair food has coconut oil and argonut oil so this one the coco the hair food strength is the strengthening softening and nourishing and the other one seals ends fights frizz and adds shine so what i like to do is after the coconut oil i will go in with uh oh my gosh which one did i go in with I think I go in with the beeswax and then I add the hair food last. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do that right now. We're going to speed through that process and then I'm going to come back. This is going to be like my last activity for the day. The time right now is around 5 p.m. And then I'm going to, like during the night, I'm going to take my time to braid my hair because I like keeping my hair braided during winter as like a protective hairdo because I don't like touching my hair a lot during winter because the air during winter is very dry and it does dry out my hair and I wanna I wanna protect my hair as much as possible during winter <laughs> that's my mom so that's what we're gonna do but before i braid my hair i'm definitely gonna be cutting my split ends i haven't cut my split ends in i think since since i did my faux locks i think that was the last time i cut my split ends so that's what i'm also going to do but yeah i'm probably not going to show you guys how i do my braids because it's, it's going to be pointless for me to record that part because you're not going to even see it properly but yeah that's what we're gonna do Hey guys welcome welcome to another day um it's late in the day like do you guys see this kind of like a trend in my vlogs i always start like my vlogs pretty late in the day but so today what i'm doing is i want to make tortillas or like wraps or like naan bread whatever you want to call it damn my mouth is so dry but i want to make those today i've been craving them a lot and when I was in Cape Town, I used to buy them at like um at spa, but the spa here at home they don't have them, which is weird. Shoprite doesn't have them. Like what the heck? So I'm gonna make them. This is gonna be my first attempt at making them, y'all. Like <laughs> this might blow up in my face. Okay, but I'm just gonna set you guys up so that you guys can see a little bit of what I'm doing, and also later on in the day. I'm going to show you guys the other stuff that I bought from Mr. Price because I promised to show you guys the stuff yesterday and I didn't, okay? So, now let's get to this vlog, y'all. Let's get to this vlog.
Okay, guys, so I am finally done, and I'm gonna show you guys my pig right now. Like, it looks delicious, y'all. It looks delicious. Um, the, tit the tortillas or the bread wrap, the bread wraps are a little bit on the dry side just because I didn't keep them in a container that's like tight, but that doesn't matter, okay? So I'm just gonna char right now. Human being, are you? What? This is good, y'all. Mm, mm, mm. Is this how you are going to, to take care of this family when I am gone? To give them joy. I don't look for 